welcome back. On Sunday, me and my family are leaving for South Carolina. We're going on a family trip to Charleston and we'll be there for about a week. So over the course of the next few days, I have a lot of stuff that I need to do to prepare for the trip. I need to obviously pack and I want to plan out all my outfits, get a fresh set of acrylics because I haven't had nails on for the past month or so, but I definitely want to get a set for our trip. So I need to get a set of acrylics. I need to get my toes done, my eyebrows done, go clothes shopping and pick up a few pieces for the outfits that I've been planning. And I also need to go get some like travel size toiletries. I also want to deep clean my whole room and organize that way when I come home from the trip. I'm going to be a little bit less overwhelmed with all the stuff that I need to do to get back into my routine. Usually I plan to do this and then I don't end up having a chance to do it. But I do like to always plan to like deep clean my whole room before I leave. Within the next few days we'll be kicking this off. Um, I have work and I have a lot of things I actually have to do in addition to these preparation things. So it's going to be a chaotic week but it should be a good time. And then I will be starting a new vlog for my travel and my trip to Charleston. Hello you guys, it is Wednesday. I just got home from work. I'm so tired and honestly I don't really feel good, I don't know why. But I have to prep for this trip so I think today I'm gonna clean my room because I'm gonna start outfit planning and like packing. So that means I'm gonna be pulling a lot of my clothes out and like laying them on the floor and stuff. I just want everything to be clean before I start putting anything on the floor. I'm gonna put on a show and start cleaning. Hopefully it will go fast. My little life hack to cleaning my room is that I like to first take everything off of all the surfaces that I'm gonna wipe down and put it on the floor or on my bed or something. And then I like to go around and wipe everything down. I don't know why doing this feels so much quicker and like so much less work to me than going from surface to surface and taking everything off and then cleaning it, putting it back on and then repeating that. I feel like just taking everything off at once, cleaning everything and then putting everything back on is so much easier. If you feel like cleaning is overwhelming, that's a way that it feels a little less overwhelming to me. So. dead you guys gaining some motivation I'm feeling a little bit better too now I'm gonna pull everything off my floor I'm gonna sweep and sweep for the whole room that should be about it I think that's all I need to clean halfway there <laughs> I'm gonna do is my laundry. I need to make sure that all my clothes are clean and ready to go in my suitcase. Hello you guys. 
guys happy thursday it's 11.02 right now the plan for today is that my sister and i are about to go to the mall she's gonna get like some last minute pieces i also want to stop at barnes and noble and get a book to bring on the trip with me we're also gonna go to target and stock up on some like travel size stuff and toiletries got a lot of shopping to do and then later on tonight i'm actually gonna get down to it and start packing at the mall i really am just looking for like two things i just want to get a white tube top and a black tube top i have this vision in my head of like these flowy pants that i have with a black tube top and some black sandals which i also need to get so black tube top black sandals and then i also want to get a white tube top to wear with like this maxi skirt that i have so i think that's it and then maybe if i see anything cute i'll grab that as well successful shopping day we both got a lot of stuff and then we just got lunch late Probably lunch slash dinner yeah. yeah we got some appetizers at cheesecake which is like our spot i love we're, we we're cheesecake patrons we, we, we are, are literally loyal customers we're loyal customers we'll do a haul later i don't know if you will maybe yeah something. or maybe you can I'll show do them a myself, haul, yeah. though. and then right now we're just going to run to trader joe's quick to get something for her boss and, and then, then we're going to Target to get our cure. And products. then so I have to start packing. But we had a very successful shopping day, and we got a lot of. I got a lot of stuff. I got I got like some good things, but you definitely yeah, exceeded me. I splurged, but it's okay because I love all of it. So we'll show you guys later. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> me and my sister are finally home from our day of shopping. It's six nineteen, so we had a really long day. It was definitely very successful. I got a ton of stuff, so I want to show you guys everything I got. First, we went to Marshalls, and I got two things from Marshalls. I got these pants just like these blue they're not linen but they're kind of like that type of vibe just like flowy nice material pants and then i also got this dress which i feel like is going to be so perfect for south carolina giving southern belle you know so the top here is kind of like a corset and then the bottom is just this cute little skirt from Target. This is actually for my mom. Me and my sister decided to get a little thank you gift for our mom for the trip. So we got her this little dress and we're gonna write her a thank you note and put together a cute little bag to give her tonight. So we just got her this dress. This is like one of her favorite colors. High up here and then it's just a nice long flowy dress with some like ruffles at the bottom. So we thought this would be super cute for her to wear on the trip. Next from Target for myself, I just got some sunscreen this is the hero cosmetics force shield sunscreen i absolutely love this product you guys it's so nice here you can see the sunscreen is also green so when you put it on it cancels out any redness that you have and then i also just got some rail beauty pimple patches because i was out of these from sephora I got this Paula's Choice liquid exfoliant. I have the travel size of this and I've been using it for about a month now and I've absolutely loved it so far. I feel like my skin is looking really clear. The tone is looking super even. My pores are looking small. Like I feel like my skin is just achieving more of that glass look every day. I also got this Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream. I love this product too. I know a lot of people say that it breaks their skin out and they don't like it because it has fragrance in it but honestly i have really sensitive skin and i've never had an issue with this product i love this packaging it's so gorgeous like the little gold spoon is just so bougie then from barnes and noble i got a book to take on the trip this is the hotel nantucket by ellen hildebrand ellen hildebrand is like the staple author of summer so she's definitely the perfect author to bring along on vacation with me so now moving on to airy i first got this white athletic type material shirt super cute it's got like a nice v-neck it's like a seamless look 
And the thing I love most about this is that it's double lined, so it's not see-through at all. This is perfect. I've been looking for a plain white tee like this that's not see-through for so long. I also got that same shirt just in a tank top. Also from Aerie, I got these super cute white joggers. I wish you guys could feel these. They literally feel like a cloud. They're so soft, super baggy, and like oversized, which I love. Um, it'll be so comfy. So I think these are going to be my airport outfit because they're also pretty thin, which is awesome for the summer. Next from Garage, I just got two tube tops. I got a white tube top and then I also got a black tube top. And then from Tilly's, I got these Levi shorts. I love these so much. They're like a Bermuda like baggy dad short. And I'm so obsessed with these. They're the 501 shorts, high rise. Last but not least, looking a little weird in this bag, but I just got these black sandals. Super cute, just a plain black sandal with this like leather braiding on it. That is everything I got. So I'm gonna put this all away and fold the laundry that I washed last night. And then I'm gonna start packing some outfits and just laying out some outfits that I want to wear. It is 9.15, it's a lot later, and guess what? I still have not started laying out my outfits or packing. I'm procrastinating really badly because packing just stresses me out. Like I feel like I'm going to lose things, I'm going to forget things, but I am going to start tonight. I promise I'm going to start tonight. I'm at least going to do a few outfits. This is the little bag that has my mom's dress in it that me and my sister got her. I wrote her out just like a little cute card. I'm just waiting for my sister to get home and sign it. And then we'll put it in the bag and give it to her. And then I also did this one for my aunt from my dog. Because <laughs> she's coming over to watch my dog. So I did do that. So I have been doing something. And I also folded all of my laundry and put all that away. Over there on my bear, I have all the new clothes that I got laid out. Because I want to definitely pack all of those. I'm going to start right now. I'm using this video for motivation. So I just laid out all of this stuff on my bed. These are some outfit choices. So I have like some daytime outfits. These are some dresses and then that's some beach cover-ups. Over there on the bear is some pieces that I definitely want to bring, but I don't know how I'm going to style them yet. And then I have shoes here. I'm going to try all of this on now. I'll show you guys the outfits if they end up being cute. Outfit number one have the black tube top with these blue flowy comfy pants and then my black sandals yeah super casual chill i have two options for bottoms for this outfit so i have the white tube top on and right now i have on this little maxi skirt but then i also have another pair of flowy pants with some pink and orange flowers so i'm gonna try these on with the tube top I think I like the skirt. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do the skirt. The outfit number three is gonna be this little overall look. Super cute. I don't know if I should wear it open like this. I kind of like it open. Or I could wear it closed like this. Both are super cute. So I guess we'll just see what we're feeling that day. I probably wear these with just some white sneakers. And all these outfits are super basic and plain, which I like because I could switch things out if I don't like the way something's looking the day of. I feel like the vibe of Charleston is very like coastal cowgirl, just fun and colorful. So I'm definitely going to do some basic outfits and then some fun accessories and like jewelry and stuff to spice it up. As I'm packing, I'm putting the stuff that I'm for sure bringing in here. So I'm trying on all the stuff that's laid out on my bed. Once I try an outfit on and I'm like for sure packing it, I'm putting it in here. This is another potential outfit. Just some white straight leg jeans with this orange cross neck top. I'm going to try the top on with these too. Just like some mid-rise straight leg regular jeans. These are the other options. I don't know. I think both are cute. Here's another option. This one I'm not too sure about. I can't tell if this is like cute, trendy, or like literally so ugly. So whatever. I have on the 
Levi's little dad jean Bermuda shorts I got today. This green like knit tank top and then just a white linen button up. I think it's the shorts that are throwing me off, but I'm just not used to wearing a style like this. But I don't hate it. Yes, I'm obsessed with this little romper. I feel like this would be super cute for like a day of shopping or just like a nice fancier lunch or even dinner. But it's giving me a little more daytime vibes because of the bright color. How cute. I feel like a little southern girl. <laughs> Imagine with my hair curled or like a little blowout. This will be great for dinner one night. I was thinking I'm going to bring this. Just a cute little sun dress. If you guys haven't noticed, I love strapless things. In the summer, I love having my shoulders out, like nice and tan. This is what I have going so far for packing. Pretty much everything I need is here in this basket. So I'm just going to go through everything one more time tomorrow. And then I will put it in my actual suitcase. It's Friday. It's like 8.30 p.m. right now. I have not filmed at all today. I haven't filmed since packing and outfit planning last night. But today I had work and then I got my nails and my toes done. These are my nails. I just got a almond shape with this light pink color. And I got the same color on my toes, but I will not be showing my toes on YouTube. I tried out a new nail salon, which I know is pretty risky right before a trip, but the nail salon that I've been going to for a long time, I had a horrible experience there last time I was there. So I'll not be going back there. And I haven't really been getting my nails done because I just hate sitting in there. It takes so long like today. This is a full set of acrylics with gel. And then I got a gel pedicure and it took three hours. So that just like wastes my whole day and I don't like that. Summer rain on a window Watch the time float on I don't know if you could see. My sister went thrifting like a few weeks ago and found a shirt with the name of the place we're going to. And she I just, just realized, realized it as now. she was packing it. Or knows her mom that. How cool. We should try to find it. McKelvin Surf Shop. Yeah, that's so funny. That's I wonder dope. if they still sell that shirt. Take apart all the good things Stripped away what's there to do So many times I try But I just don't remember Best hair care ever. Floor floor. o'clock i feel like i've been packing for 10 hours but i pretty much have everything except the few last minute things that i'm gonna throw in tomorrow before i leave this is my suitcase pretty much have everything in here have my shoes a hat my pajamas outfits everything this is my little carry-on bag so 
in here to have my computer, some stuff that I want to have on the plane with me, a book, headphones, and then this is my outfit for the plane with my shoes and everything. I can't tell if I severely overpacked or if I forgot literally everything and I have nothing to wear. So that will be a fun surprise when I get there. It's Saturday. I just got home from work. Now I'm just going to throw one last load of laundry into the wash and then I'm going to get in the shower and take an everything shower. <laughs> As you guys can see, I'm all showered and clean. I shaved, did all my lotion, everything, so I feel super nice and cozy. But I think I'm gonna end this video off here. Tomorrow I'm gonna start a new video for my travel and my whole trip to Charleston. So definitely make sure to watch that if you're interested. I'm so excited. I think it's gonna be a great time. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next one. See you in Charleston.